Hello everyone, this is Pastor Sean from Christians Unite, and this is a video series called Topics. On today's topic video, we're going to be talking about why Christians should celebrate Christmas. So there's a lot of times where you go online and there's these people that always, every year without fail, come online and basically say, hey, it's wrong to celebrate Christmas because of these facts. Um, and it's always the same thing. It's pagan rooted. It's um, not when Jesus was actually born. They get their facts from that. And that's fine. They can do that. But what I would like to tell you is that you have freedom in Christ to celebrate Christmas. Now, the reason I celebrate Christmas and why you should celebrate Christmas, because it is the day that we remember that God literally descended from his throne and took on human flesh for us. We sinned and we disobeyed and God sacrificed everything to be on earth with us and experience life as we do. He didn't have to do that. It, it wasn't something that he was required to do or had to do. He chose to do that because he loves us. So on that day in Bethlehem, whenever it was, it may have been on December 25th. It may have been sometime in June or whatever the facts say. Never, nevertheless, we still celebrate it as the day our Savior was born. And that's what we need to remember. The focus of Christmas is to celebrate Jesus Christ and his birth. And the reason we give presents to each other is to remind us of that gift that he gave us. Now, some people will disagree with that. That's completely fine. You can disagree all you want, but don't judge other people because they decide to celebrate in that way. And there's many representations behind the other things as well. If you watch Saving Christmas by Kirk Cameron, he explains a ton of different symbolism and different things that you're missing. So when we put up a tree, that symbolizes the tree of life. When you see the star, that's the star of David, the star that led the shepherds to Jesus in the manger. If you look at the twinkling lights, that's the stars in the sky. And you could do this. You can look at Christmas in this way and say, hey, I can focus on Christ during this day. Another reason that Christmas can be celebrated during this month, and another reason why I do it, it brings families together. It's the one day where your whole entire family might be coming together under one roof. And you can fellowship with one another. And that's really good because that's what God wants. He wants fellowship. Also in churches, we celebrate the birth of Jesus as a community together. There's nothing wrong with that at all. So this Christmas, remember Jesus Christ as the true meaning of Christmas. Now, as far as the other things like Santa Claus and the make-believe, that's just fun for children and there's nothing wrong with that but you should tell your children the truth you can tell them Santa's real but you need to make sure that you tell them that it was Saint Nicholas who was alive at one point who did give gifts to children so at some point you do need to tell your children the truth if you have any questions or if you have any concerns about this, please message me directly. I will help you understand this further. Um, also, I would recommend watching Saving Christmas by Kirk Cameron. Um, there's a ton of stuff on there as well that gives you information about 
why Christians can celebrate Christmas. Thank you for listening to this edition of Topics. Have a wonderful evening.